and it looks like Kurt Browning's going to have to come up with some 11s here. Got to be perfect to hang in, I think. Oh, and Roz, it looks like we have a biased crowd. <laughs> I guess they're worried because they know the men need a mathematical miracle to come out with this one. It just went up to 11. You can give 11s. I mean, I, I mean, I, I, I... It won't matter to Browning, though. This number is sensational. Hello. I'm the guy who sits next to you and reads the newspaper over your shoulder. <laughs> Off to a great start. Here I am by Lyle Lovett. This number has everything. It's got great choreography, great jumps, and watch the character. Woo! Don't turn the page. Life is so uncertain. wondering about that suit that's actually from his television special singing in the rain he said hey i think this could work for this number sure enough the triple toes intellectual and emotional compatibility are at the very least difficult if not impossible to come by we could always opt for the more temporal gratification sheer physical attraction <laughs> Again, Kurt is the most versatile skater in the professional ranks. The acting, with the choreography. You know what, he has the most talented feet. I know that sounds strange, but feet, he's got such footwork. That wouldn't make you a shallow person, would it? with the character. I understand too little too late. I realize there are things you say and do you can never take back. But what would you be if you didn't even try? You have to try. So after a lot of thought, I'd like to reconsider. If it's not too late, please, please, I don't think I've ever seen anyone have so much fun out there. I, I think it's just natural born talent. Give him a 12. He always gives me the feeling he wants to just stay out there all night long. Just keep skating, audience or no audience, just, and that's when you know someone really loves what they're doing. Close the door in our face with Katarina Bitt, but Kurt Browning, he sure closed the show. I mean competition. It was no competition, Peter. Uh. <laughs> well, well, 
Well, maybe there's some 10-1s. Asked him for it. 10-1. 10.1. 10-1. Did you kiss your hand goodbye over there? Huh? That is so good. That was it. I was kissing my heart like goodbye. Good job. They did throw Ladies some 11s. Here are oh the final totals. Here we go, 398.04. 398.04. 398 <laughs> the winners. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. And the champions of Battle of the Sexes are coming to the ladies. Katarina's saying she gets her feet rubbed, something she loves to have done. And what do you think? Perfect setup for Battle of the Sexes on Ice 3. Well, Ross, the series is tied 1 1. How about a rematch? Well, we will be coming into the arena next year on our Harleys with, check it out, diamond earrings. Guys are looking awfully empty handed. Ladies loving their Zales diamonds. Wow. Man, you guys cleaned up. Life is really hard. Guys, we got the Harley, we got the diamonds, we want the helmets. We want the diamonds and motorcycles. What more could you want? Yeah. Strike one up for equality. For Rosalind Sumner's Peter Crothers and our entire crew, I'm Susie Calver. So long from Las Vegas.